welcome to yet another exciting shift show. We have here with us Mr. Michael from Blendjet. Hello, sir. How are you? Very good. I'm good to see you again this year. I'm glad to be back in Dubai. Same here. Same here, sir. So, sir, we have a lot of products here. Uh, what are the key features about the, these products? Well, I think the, the beauty of uh, the Blendjet brand and what we bring to the table mm -hmm. is the convenience and portability to mm -hmm. take healthy anywhere you go and everywhere you go. Right. So if you're going to the office and you want to take a smoothie with you in the car, you want to make it at the office, you want to have it at the gym, right. uh, it's, it's there for you when you want it on demand. And you don't have to worry about taking it out of a cabinet and unwinding a cable and okay. plugging it into the wall because it's, it's already done for you. If yeah. you. You charge it up for an hour and it lasts a good 20, 25 cycles of, uh, of mixing. Right, right. So sir, uh, do these have different kind of benefits or features or how is it like? Yeah, I think I think the exciting thing about the, the brand itself is that we come out with so many different colors. So there's a whole rainbow of solid colors that you can wow. choose from. Black, mint, hot pink, purple, red, royal blue. And then we've also come up with uh, things like this, which is patterns. Mm -hmm. Black marble, geode, white marble, leopard prints. Wow. Uh, so here in this market, uh, we have at least uh, 19 solid colors and seven prints to choose from. So you can actually match it to your mood. Wow. You can match trends. You can match the inside of your kitchen. Whatever you want to do, whatever kind of personality you have. Uh, and then I think another nice feature is we have add-on accessories mm -hmm. as well. So using the same base, okay. we have the ability for you to uh, purchase an accessory, which is if you want to double the size of the capacity, okay. you can buy this version, okay. which is just a jar with okay. a top. Okay. And it fits onto the same base and it has the same amount of power, can still crush ice, can crush frozen food. Wow and you can make even more. Maybe you want to do it for your children or you want to do the whole family. You can use this version. Wow, wow. And I see it was when you rotated, that there's this thing that blinks yes. the button. Yeah, it tells you if you're dislodged. So if you don't have the jar so not... properly attached, right. so it'll it blink red. Right. It'll tell you it's not uh, aligned properly. So you right. just put the two arrows in the back together. Yeah. Okay. And then you're able to, it gives you a signal that you're able to start blending. You don't want it to accidentally start. Perfect. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Without the lid on. Yeah. Uh, so it will not, it will not work without this jar properly attached. Okay. Oh, wow. Yeah. Perfect. And you can also use the lock mode. So you can actually push the button and hold for three seconds. It will lock it. So if you put it into your bag and you carry it, mm -hmm. it won't accidentally start uh, when you're on the go. Oh, well, yeah. So it's good for the children. For those mothers who have children, oh, who yes, have naughty yeah. children. I, I, I would not suggest children under 12 <laughs> operate it themselves. Absolutely. I think, you know, adult supervision is Absolutely. required because it does have a, a sharp blade on it, mm -hmm. which is used to crush the ice. Right, right. It makes a great product. Yes. So, you know, as long as you're with your children and they they put it together properly and put the right ingredients in, it can be perfectly safe for them. Perfect, perfect. So, sir, uh, now that we've uh, established uh, the benefits of these products. Yep. Um, how do you differentiate with competition? Well, you know, I think the differentiator is there's a lot of um, knockoff imports. Mm -hmm. We were the first to come up with this product. So mm -hmm. we pioneered the category of portable blenders. Mm -hmm. There's been other companies that have generic names that try to bring product into the market mm -hmm. and sell against Blendjet. Mm -hmm. They just don't have the uh, power, mm -hmm. they don't have the performance features, they don't have the quality. Most of them just jam when you try to put ice in them. Oh, okay. Ours clearly cuts the ice okay. and makes you a very good protein drink or a good smoothie with frozen fruit. Mm -hmm. So it can handle pretty tough uh, tough conditions compared to the competition. Okay. You know, there are some name brands that have followed us into the portable category. Mm -hmm. It's not their specialty. Okay. They're actually making plug-in countertop blenders. They're trying to put a product up against ours. They come in two or three colors. They just don't have the pizzazz, the energy, and the passion for the portable category that we have. Great. So, sir, uh, do you have any patents or are you looking out or something like that to help you 
uh, stand out or something like that? Uh, the what? The patents? Pa patents for your... Oh, yeah, yeah. We have, uh, we have over 40 patents on our products. So wow. everything from the blade design and the turbojet technology, which is an off-center design. Mm -hmm. uh, we also have a six blade where competition only has four blades inside. Oh. So we're, we're doing things that the competition don't spend the time and the money on. Yeah. And we're also protecting our patents in the market. Mm -hmm. um, so, and we're always looking at upgrading and adding new features and making the next version better. So we are coming up with a new version starting in the new year in okay. 2025 wow that's going to upgrade the current which is called the blendjet 2 mm -hmm. we're going to move to the blendjet 3. wow On do you want to hear about it yeah absolutely please, okay please go ahead uh yeah so what the, the unique features of the blendjet 3 will be uh a port cover so where the usb cable goes inside Perfect. we've added a rubber cover right. in order to prevent any water getting in and damaging the machine right uh, if you follow the instructions and you don't immerse this base, yeah. you're okay. Yeah. But in case something happens unexpected, we're putting a rubber cover on it to help protect. Right. We've also used the sound dampening bottom on it, which is a little different than the current um, three rubber Get it. pads on the bottom. Right. So this entire ring will help kill about 25 to 30% of the sound, right. oh. make it quieter wow. when you operate it on a table. And then we're adding standard a drinking lid. So this is called the Orbiter drinking lid, which we designed and developed. And it just, you can actually, when you're holding, you can actually push it open and close with one finger. Right. Uh, it's not a flip lid, so it doesn't go into your nose or go into the side of your face when you're trying to drink. Right. It spins and it's a very comfortable to drink out of. Right. Perfect. So on that note. Yes. Um, how do you stay relevant with the current market situation? Uh, you know, I think what we're, o we're always doing is uh, looking at how people use the product. Yeah. We're looking at how people uh, react to different colors, how they uh, see things in the marketplace as trends come. Yeah. Because we are, call it a fashion item. Absolutely. I mean, you know, you want to pick something up that looks good that you could leave on your countertop and you're right. proud to have out. You right. don't have to find ways to hide it when someone comes to visit you. So uh, we're always innovating in terms of the features that go into the product, making it easier to drink from, mm -hmm. make it more useful for you to carry with you. And uh, I mean, it's just, it's an awesome product where we are focused on the portable category and that's what we're all about. We don't waste time on large commercial machines or countertop machines. We focus on this primarily and all the time. That's that's pre precisely why you guys are here at the Shift Show. Yeah. And finally, I would like to ask you, um, how do you feel about the Shift Show this year? And uh, has there any, um, so there are two parts of this question. Okay. So uh, has there any challenges or successes that you would like to share in the past one year? Well, I, I one, I want to commend the, the SHIFT organization for putting together this show. I think it's a great idea. I, I really enjoy the aspect of being able to work one-on-one -on -one with retailers. Mm -hmm. Being in, not in a major trade show hall where you have people walking through and your attention is not on the customer. Uh, what I find is the feedback coming from customers telling me about the product and what they're hearing for, from people they're selling the product to. I can take that back and work with my technology and design team to upgrade product mm -hmm. and make changes that are relevant to the marketplace and the needs of our consumer. That's right. So this is a great way to do it. I think this is an excellent venue and it's very comfortable to work here. And uh, I, I appreciate them doing this very much. I think that the market, uh, we've done very well in the market here in the Middle East, mm -hmm. um, in Dubai, uh, throughout the UAE, and the other markets that they service for us. They've done a phenomenal job of growing the business. Um, we enjoy the relationship that we have with Shift, how they support our brand, and how in turn the retailers that they're selling to also yes. share in the success and uh, are doing well with it. That's great. Uh, thank you so much uh, you. for your time, sir. And it's always been fun and exciting to have you. And uh, 
Stay tuned for more updates to TechX Media. Thank you. Thank you.